Each of the boys will perform a sacred song of their choice. Going first is 13-year-old Samuel from York. But before we hear him sing, here he is talking to Kate. How are you feeling? Right. Cool as a cucumber, you Sam. I think there's a mix of excitement and nerves. I think my mum's a bit more nervous than that. Oh, is she? Yeah. And you've been singing since you were quite young, haven't you? Yes, so uh, I had a little piano organ. I would be obsessed with playing one of these songs and singing along or, or doing ridiculous dances to it. As Samuel's interest in music grew, he joined his local church choir. And then, age nine, he auditioned for the choir of York Minster and was offered a place. And what was it like singing in that big cathedral choir, in that Minster choir? Even though you got sort of used to the building and the singing, it was still an amazing experience. And whilst it sort of did dominate your life, it was a nice routine to get into and, and you made good friends. And that came to an end because I had to retire <laughs> at the age of 13. Um, Old and past it at yes. the age of 13, <laughs> Sam. I'm now in a little church choir that sings on Sunday mornings. Is it just the singing or do you do other bits of music as well? Yes, I play um, the piano as well as the French horn, and I've started learning the viola and the ukulele. What are you going to be singing? Um, I'm going to be singing uh, How Beautiful Are the Feet from Handel's Messiah. It's a, quite a strange piece because it's, it's almost a mixture of happy and sad at the same time. It's in a minor key. It's very calm and very soothing, and the lyrics are hap uh, very happy as well. I wish you all blessings. I hope it goes really well, and I'll be praying for you. Uh, not easy going first. It's not easy going first, but um, actually Samuel didn't look like he, he was bothered about that at all. <laughs> that was absolutely beautiful. Well done. Uh, one of the things I particularly uh, want to commend you for is how you were able to come in on very high notes, out of the blue, and you weren't at all bothered. It was a beautiful sense that you were owning those very high notes. So very well done. Thank you, Howard. Catherine, good choice for you. I love this piece of music. When you opened your mouth and the first note came out, you asked, it took me by surprise by the beautiful tone of your voice. It's really, really gorgeous. And what's difficult and challenging about this piece is the breath control and, and your intonation, your tuning was spot on. The only thing that I would, I would ask to bear in mind is think of the words, you know, to bring glad tidings. But if you could look slightly warmer in your performance because it's glad tidings, just sing with a little bit of a smile. David, what did you think? When you, you came in on that very first note, I was, uh, I sat up. And from the moment you began, we were into the song. We were into the feeling of it. And at no point did you lose focus. And once again, on that glad, the crescendo was superb. 
Well done. Thank you, judges, and thank you, Samuel. <laughs> Sam! How did it go? Really well. Yeah, I'm really pleased with those points and my performance. Brilliant. And were you nervous? Oh, yeah. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> well, you hit it well. Yeah. Did you enjoy it? Yes, definitely. It was a really nice experience, and it was nice to see all the applause and the smiles. Well,